Hey everyone, my name's Joey, I'm with Perfect Gardens. In this video, we're at the Maximum Yield Show in San Francisco, and we're checking out the Gorilla Grow Tents. They're very popular, or becoming even more popular, and I wanted to really see, are they worth the money? Are they one of the best grow tents on the market? I hadn't seen them in person up until this point, so you guys let me know what you think, and let's go check it out. Gorilla Grow Tents, tallest, thickest, strongest. I wanted to find out if this is true, I wanted to find out if they're worth the money. They're uh, getting a lot of buzz in the industry as the best grow tent on the market and the best quality. So I wanted to find out, and this was the first time I saw it in person. Right now I'm looking at a 4x4 grow tent, and I'm going to be looking at the vent holes in the upper right corner. What's important about vent holes with grow tents is that they can accommodate 8-inch ducting. A lot of times I've had to use 8-inch ducting in a grow tent, and it was really hard to get it through the vent holes, and that's just a pain in the ass when you're setting everything up. So looking for those uh, vent holes to be big was important. Another cool thing is the way that everything kind of clicks together and snaps together. Um, as you can see here, there is no plastic used at all in their grow tent. It's all metal, and uh, that's a very cool thing and what makes it very strong, I think. The material used to reflect it is very cool. It's like a, a diamond foil reflective material. I've never seen these inside of grow tents. I've seen them used for walls, but uh, not for grow tent. In this 5x9, I was showing you guys how they have their vent holes set up. You can see that they have it so you can do a sealed room and just ventilate your lights alone. And then you also have vent holes that you can use for things like your carbon filter and have everything separate. So if you're going to go with a sealed room, it's really convenient. Another cool thing was that they had a pouch on the side. And that's pretty cool if you want to keep some of your tools in there. Um, anything that's vital or anything that you're using on a regular basis, it's really convenient to have that there. Like all the other grow tents, they also have the vents towards the bottom because you need to have somewhere for that cold air to come in if you're going to be exhausting the hot air. And they also have windows, which is really cool. It doesn't come with all the grow tents on the market, only a few. And the zipper is really important here. I, I was really impressed with their zippers. They're super high quality. They reminded me of a jacket, you know, like a really high quality expensive jacket you would have that would have a very strong zipper. That's what their zippers reminded me of. Very, very high quality zipper. And you can see it. Just look at those teeth on that thing. And then on the inside, the flap that used, they use to cover it and prevent any light leaks is very strong. As I lift it up, it wasn't easy in the sense of, you know, felt flimsy. It's going to stay down. Uh, it's going to be hard to flip that up. So that's, that's very good and very important. I really wanted to capture the fact that I'm inside a 10 foot grow tent. In my life I've never been inside or seen a 10 foot tall grow tent so it was very interesting to kind of look up and be like wow you know that's taller than most houses are even going to be. Most of the time we only go up to 8 feet so it was really cool to see how high it went. And of course he had to hold himself up to show me that it really is strong. His feet are completely off the ground. I have to give it A plus to the uh, Gorilla Grow Tent guys. They, they did a great job and they have a really great product.